And so, Shefty, as we hear about all of this breaking news surrounding Tom Brady not returning to the Patriots, but we're trying to figure out where he may go. Yesterday on this show, you were just throwing out a few teams. You said the yep. Bucks, you said the Chargers, you said the Raiders and the Dolphins. As you try and look at this, what do you think is most likely for Brady right now? Well, let me say this, Laura, right now. I can tell you this, which has been confirmed. He does not have a decision right now. He is exploring his options. And I do believe there are options, despite the skepticism that some have had. He's Tom Brady. And yes, there are teams out there, and there are many teams that have gone through this exercise of trying to figure out, are we better off with the guy we have playing quarterback, or are we better off making a move at the quarterback we have right now, that position, and moving on and bringing in Tom Brady. And so there are teams that have gone through this. One team just called up just joking. Hey, we're going to trade our quarterback right now and bring in Tom Brady. But the fact of the matter is where we're at today, right now, he does not have a decision. He's exploring his options. He's not going to rush into a decision to make a decision to sign somewhere else until he's ready. And in this day and age where the coronavirus is going on, he's not allowed to visit with other teams. So maybe there could be FaceTime calls. Certainly there'll be conversations that occur. But he believes that he is far enough along to make the decision that I'm not going to go back to New England, which tells you that he had to be in this spot all along. And he had to know that when he was walking off that field in Foxborough after the playoff loss to Tennessee, he had to know in his mind at that point in time that there was a real possibility that he would not be returning there as the quarterback of the New England Patriots. And so now we sit back and it's two decades it's two decades of sustained excellence where this franchise and this quarterback have combined to win six Super Bowls. And now there are going to be fresh starts for each. Where Tom Brady winds up, we'll see. You mentioned those options. The Chargers, the Buccaneers, the Dolphins, others that are weighing whether or not to make a move on Tom Brady. And then the Patriots. What do they do with the quarterback position? And the Patriots, as we said, are a very patient thoughtful organization. I don't think they're going to rush into anything because Tom Brady announces that he's leaving. It's not like today they're going to go sign Philip Rivers, who's been talking to the Colts, or go trade for a quarterback that's out there right now. They'll sit back, they'll let the quarterback landscape calm down, and they'll make a move at the right time. And it may just be that they want to win without a high-priced quarterback. It may be that they take their resources and allocate them to the defensive side of the football and begin rebuilding. They've got Jared Stidham, an inexpensive quarterback on a rookie contract. Maybe you go draft another rookie quarterback. Maybe you sign one of these free agent quarterbacks that's left standing without a deal in a couple of weeks, which is the Patriot way. And maybe you got three quarterbacks there left vying for a spot. They have time to sort through this, but the bottom line is two decades are over and Tom Brady's moving on, the Patriots are moving on, and it becomes a historical day. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.